Okay, hello everyone and welcome back to Hollow Knight. Well, <clears throat> I'm gonna be honest with you guys, it has been a hot minute since I've played Hollow Knight, hasn't it? Honestly, there is no particular reason. Uh, it's not like I, you know, got bored of this game or whatever. I'm probably more into this game than ever, especially uh, at the end of the last couple of episodes. You know, I've been making some progress in some new areas and shit. So I'm like really into this game. It's just, you know, things got in the way. Uh, so it was not intentional that I've not been playing this game. So yeah, I think this is where we left off in general. Yeah, these royal waterways, uh, which we are going to explore. I do see the path or I do see a path. Uh, I don't even remember what enemies are here. So yeah, oh shit. I always forget we can swim in this game. It kind of is a weird thing, isn't it? When you think about it. Because insects are like notoriously shit swimmers. Most of them, I should say. Uh, I don't know what this main character is. He's like a beetle type thingy. But... I don't know, bruh. I mean, this game has talking bugs with a built-in society, so... Who am I to talk about what's realistic and what ain't? Oh shit, what the hell? What the hell is that? Rancid egg. I've been picking up a couple of these, uh, which is weird because you cannot sell it to the dude. You know, that antique dealer or whatever in... I almost said Majula. <laughs> uh, in the City of Tears, I think it's called. Shit, I'm nearly dead. So yeah, we cannot sell it to him. So I don't know, like... What they're useful for. Assume there will be something where we'll be able to use them up. I'm checking my map quite a bit. Oh, shit. Man, those exploding bird thingies are annoying. He's just making dog noises, that enemy. Okay, fuck you. Ain't gonna explode on me. Alright, cool. This is where we gotta go, I think. This looks like the way forward. I mean, we gotta have the obligatory sewer area, right? Just part of... Part of how the game works. Okay. What? Oh, is that the dude? You know which dude I'm talking about. The dude. The other, the the guy who looks like... There's some weird shit, boys. This could also be a boss. Sounds like he's speaking Italian. Oh, fuck. You have got to be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. Dong Defender. Holy shit. The last thing I expected. I kind of didn't want... Oh, he... That is all shit, isn't it? Oh, he, he is really swinging his shit around. Or flinging his shit around, I should say. God damn it. Talk about a shit eating grin. He's kind of adorable though. Oh, how many times have I missed with that? I think every single time. Okay, I got a couple of good hits in. Okay. Oh, 
He's now the shit. He has become the shit. This feels very much like a... This is a very Mega Man-ish boss. Oh, fuck. I... As soon as I started healing, I knew I was screwed. As soon as I... Oh, and it puts me all the ba way back. That's got to be a closer checkpoint. Well, okay. First things first, I didn't expect to meet a boss. This early on into the episode. Uh, secondly, of course, bosses in this game do not have health bars. Nor do they have, like, clear phases a lot of times. So... I have no idea how close or far away I was from beating that guy. It felt like I was doing okay. But... It's difficult to tell. You know, it is. Oh, what the hell? Oh, of course the leg wakes up. Shit. I wasted all my health thingy. Wait, did I go the right way? I didn't even go the right way, did I? Yeah, because I think it's safer to just swim there. Which I've been doing. Uh, yeah, again, that's the thing about bosses in this game. It's very difficult to tell the how close or far away you are from actually defeating them. Okay, let's just get away from him. I'd rather not take damage at this point. I say as I forget about the exploding bird. So I'm going to go and take another path and take a look around. Uh, cause this is some crazy shit. Uh, yeah. So anyways. I'm gonna be getting back into the grind of this game. I finished the Dark Souls 3 lock run, finally. That was actually... That was actually a fun run. I enjoyed it. Uh, probably the most fun I've had with Dark Souls 3 in a while. I didn't, didn't go the right way. Uh, because I'm going to be honest with you. I'm saying uh, a lot. It's really weird. I should stop. It sounds stupid. What I was going to say is, honestly, when I did the crossbow challenge run, which, if you were around, famously ended as a fucking disaster. Oh, I see. I see the little... Are you kidding me? I see the hidden wall. Which I cannot break. But I think the idea was there. Uh, what was I saying? So yeah. Oh, crossbow run. That was a fucking disaster. Uh, probably do. Shittiest run I've had ever streaming. I wouldn't say entirely my fault. My fault in the sense that I should have looked into whether it was actually feasible to play Dark Souls 3 with a crossbow. I would have quick quickly discovered that it ain't. Get the fuck out of Okay, so this is all covered in his shit, right? Because he's a dung beetle. And... Yeah, we'll leave it at that. We'll leave it at that. I mean, it's not even his shit. That's the... F Man, that's the fucked up thing about it. It's everybody else's shit. Where the hell is my... Why is it down there? Wait, does this, is this not even like a main, main boss? Because with like main bosses, 
isn't your little body, your little ghost supposed to spawn outside? Isn't that how it works? Damn, either I'm getting screwed. Very possible that I'm getting screwed. We'll return to that place in just a bit. Uh, let's let's take a look around. Because my idea is... There's got to be a bench somewhere. Bench somewheres. A closer one. Because there's no way that's like... I mean, there is a way. Runbacks are pretty significant in this game. They don't mess around with runbacks here. Okay. The, that was sick. Okay. Not 100% intentional, I will admit, but it was kind of sick. And then I... Yeah. Let's not even let's not even talk about that. This isn't even where I'm supposed to be going. Honestly. This looks like a hella dead end. Hmm. I'm still thinking there will be a various suit. Or something like that in this game. Allowing us to... <clears throat> take the heat, you know? Now, this isn't even where I'm supposed to be going. I know where I'm supposed to be going. Into that cave area. That crystal cave. Where I can now break the floor. But... I've been distracted. Maybe this is a viable path as well and leads to something but who knows so here's what we're gonna do maybe I have not explored this place fully in fact probably but I'm gonna try the boss again and we will see what happens It's pretty funny though. He if he feels very Mega Man-ish, as I said. Even like the little tunnel. I mean it could be a reference. Of course. Even then you go through this like narrow tunnel and it opens up into a room that looks like this. Oh that that's why, okay. So basically you have a safe way of getting your buddy. Dung Defender. Oh, okay. Shit. Literally. Oh. I missed my chance. To get in some good hits. Fucking volleyball. Okay, this one, he goes crazy. I'll wait for his freak out. I'll take the chance. He's pretty funny. Sounds like a someone doing an angry Italian impression. Oh God. Why am I so shit at bosses like this? Oh 
No. Oh. Okay. Fuck. Did I kill him? Ah, oh, there's shit granules flying all the... Yeah, there's shit... Oh, <laughs> we blasted him into his own shit. Oh, and he's buried. Defender's Crest. That was a pretty good boss fight. I will admit, I liked that. That was a good boss. Defender's Crest. Unique charm bestowed by the King of Hallowness to his most loyal knight. Scratched and dirty, but still, scared, still cared for. I don't want to know what dirt is on it. Causes the bearer to emit a nice game. Nice. Heroic odor. I don't know what this do. Oh, I know what it do. That's how you move on. Because it drained. It drained the acid puddle. Okay. I will admit, maybe there is no various suit in this game. Where the fuck are we? Oh, do you see the background? It's pretty cool. Now, this game has some nice ass area design. Color me impressed. Impressed. And we are back in the City of Tears. And a new part of it. In Terrest. Fuck. I'm so screwed. No, go through him. No. This is not good. This is really not good. Hmm. Okay. That very much felt out of my league. In terms of strength. This less so. What are these things? I'm just like slaughtering them, but still. What the? I knew it was gonna... I was just about to say, this has gotta have a shortcut, right? Yeah, that's it. So it is a shortcut. Uh, we have like a shit ton of areas to go to again. Because we just unlocked all of this. Which is... Essentially leading to nowhere, but... We have two elevators. I mean, the intricate level design is... I mean, to say the level design is intricate is an understatement. Can I break the floor? How do we do this? There we go. Did that achieve anything? Doesn't f really feel like we did anything with that. Aside from being dickheads to the scenery. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Still, there's this place. Oh, how the hell do you avoid that? Hmm. I'm scared of those guys. I'm 100% willing to admit those are scary ass enemies. So let's instead go back down. I didn't think this is what it would involve. It's all good. Oh shit. See, I've gotten better at these. There's another one. It's too tempting. It is too tempting. They don't even give you that much, but the 
the satisfaction of getting to them. I was just about to say. Okay, I am very, very, very close to death. No! Oh, I should have just dropped. I'm an idiot. I am an idiot. Oh, fuck, that's so far away. That's so far away. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. I mean, people say that they are enjoying the rombacks. Which are part of this game. Uh, normally, I tend to cut shit out. But I'll make an exception. See, I also have no earthly idea of how long this game is. By the way, it didn't? Yes. I was just about to say if my map updated. <laughs> but it did. It's such a strange enemy. They don't even do shit. Which makes me wonder why I'm killing them. I assume if you let them get close to you. It's a different story. Is this the po- It's not the poison water. It really looked like... It would have been. Wait, hold on. Am I even going remotely the right way? No, I'm not. I'm supposed to be down. Fuck. Could I have done a more perfect dodge into that enemy? I shouldn't get distracted. I should explore these areas one by one. Because the first thing I should do is go down to where, you know, that area was blocked by the poison water. Because I think it's no longer... Whatever is down there is now accessible. From killing this dung defender. But I'm like also interested in... What the hell is down that tunnel where I died? This game, man. Like, don't play this game if you have ADHD. Because it's going to fuck with you. It really makes you feel like... You know, without being a uh, where the fuck do I go type game... Really gives that sense of adventure. -er. All right, where all the shit be? So basically, we can put on that badge to make us smell like Dookie. Uh, to I assume like put off enemies. You know, it's a morale-destroying weapon. Okay, thanks. I think it'll last for... Oh, hello. Oh, it's you again. I'm glad to see you return. No, no, please, don't say a word. I must apologize for my previous behavior. Oh. Oh, he's a friend. I like that. Nice defend against the physical, but a formless enemy. How to defeat such a foe? I like this guy. I kind of had a feeling he wasn't going to die. Because he looked too good-natured. So basically, they are afflicted with the curse of the undead. Right? Except the insect version of it. Where the hell are you? Oh shit. Fuck. Where the hell is my... My spirit or whatever. God, it gets lost easily. I hate when it does it. It's shown to be in this area. 
God damn it. I somehow like can't concentrate when this happens. Hmm. Wonderful. Don't worry. Only 1700 souls on the line. You know, I'm going to play it safe. I am going to play it safe. Not by going and walking into the path of those giant knights, but by killing enemies here. Yeah. It's not take, you know, unnecessary risks. I feel like that's enough on the line for it to matter, you know. <laughs> Pretty good. See, I feel like... It's pretty far away, the original checkpoint, but yeah, fuck it. I'm being brave or stupid. I think both. I have no idea what the hell the point of breaking that glass was. See, now I'm wondering, because they really, shit, I'm yawning. <sighs> they didn't do nothing. All right. I look ghost form. Can you show yourself? There it is. Oh, the music is getting creepy. Thank you. Before we go any further, wow, this is a really cool area. Holy shit. How am I even supposed to get through that? As in get back up. Oh, this is going to be a pain in the ass. Wait, what? Yeah, but how do you get... Holy shit. Okay, never mind. We will cross that bridge when we get there. Uh, I'm afraid I'm not going to be able to get the fuck out of here. Please let there be like a stag station or something here. What the hell is this place? Whoa! feel like it's a really bad place to fight these guys. Yeah, that one's better. That's more like it. Come on. go who knew that I'd actually have to concentrate in a fight what the hell is this place there's a lot of treasure here which just makes me more worried because I keep accumulating stuff and I feel like I'm bound to die And that would be not a good feeling. What the shit is this? Mechanism with a slot for some kind of pass. Insert tram pass. Wait a second. Not yet. 
Okay. There's a tram tunnel. Which I'm assuming is not going to... Oops. Lead back. Ancient Basin. Holy shit. Yeah, we gotta... We gotta, like... Skip out on this for just a bit. I wanna... Oh, the tram is gonna come this way. That's even better. It's what I want more. Because that means... The fucking Lovecraftian monsters here. Don't worry. It's all good. I was gonna say something. I forgot. Never mind. There's like fucking Lovecraftian monsters here. But I did say that. Okay, this game is getting weirder and weirder. It's like fucking... Well, actually, I don't know <laughs> what it's like. I was gonna have some game in mind that starts out normal. This gets weirder and weirder as we go along. Spec Ops The Line, actually. <laughs> it's the closest I can think off the top of my... Final f fucking Final Fantasy VIII, how could I have forgotten? Prime example, that game is... I feel like they dropped acid. Like, at the end of the first disc. And they were like, fuck it boys, we're going for it. Whoa! Oh, it's you! I know I heard someone. Gasty things chased me and I ran. If you hadn't come along, who knows. I like her. She looks like the sack lady from Dark Souls 1. Tiny savior. Man, I really want to get like the badge of this little guy. This main character. There's like a pin version of him. I don't know what the hell I'd stick it to. But I feel like I have to have it. Oh shit. These enemies are bastards. Whoa. Pale ore. Oh, nice. That's for the weapon. It's hella, hella good. You know what? No. I'm gonna... I was at the tram pass. I've been getting distracted ever since. This area is really strange. Oh, please don't tell me this is a... Please don't tell me there's no way back. Oh, fuck. There's no way back. I think we're in trouble, boys. I think we are in trouble. <laughs> that, the way its head flies off is just so hilarious. Okay, this is the way back. Ouch. Metric fuck ton of damage. Yeah, this is the way back, right? This is where we met her. Yeah, okay. I think we're good. I think we are okay. I've been getting like hella distracted. I should end this episode, which I'm going to do. So I'm going to wrap up this episode here. I think the last thing we will do is get back to the tram stage the tram stage and actually unlock it nice really nice so we have like a straight shot back here if we ever need to uh, we can rest as well okay perfect I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here I don't know if I should explore this area first I feel like we should go to the crystal 
crystal caves. I don't know what else to call it. Yeah, that's, I think, what we're going to do. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Hollow Knight. I need to figure out which way to go. We will see. Yeah, thanks for watching, boys, and goodbye. Peace out.